You know, obviously we got a game tomorrow, so we're going to play one group 60 and one group 30, and then we'll flip it against Seattle. The group that played 30 will play 60. The group that played 60 will play 30. So we're slowly building them up, and we prepared both groups to play in the game tomorrow. Well, obviously from a physical load, they're going to play more minutes. Uh, so we're looking for them to be able to maintain a high tempo, a uh, high level of focus, high level of quality, high level of organization for longer minutes, the one group that's playing 60. Um, obviously, you hope that the chemistry continues to get better and better with time. We do have a lot of the same pieces, but we do have some new pieces. Um, so you want to see them start to integrate each game a little bit more and, and develop that chemistry that you're looking for, that, that cohesiveness. Um, and then I think in general, just looking for uh, everything to be a notch sharper, a notch better. I said today, you're either getting better or you're getting worse. It's simple. There's, there's two directions you go. You don't stay the same. So we want to continue to get better in training and in each game. You know, we try to make it as, as close to home as possible from the standpoint of we're training once a day, same time. We're working out of a locker room here. So you don't want them to feel like they're, um, you know, uh, in a different rhythm, but what you want is to have them around each other more. Um, we don't force that, but by being here and being in the hotels and having extra time away from the families, girlfriends, wives, um, they tend to hang out with each other more than they would when they have to go home and see the families, see the wives, and and uh, you know. So I think just it naturally happens where they're bonded a bit more here, where they're where they're concentrated. You know, for me, it's interesting to see how a team takes shape and see who's hanging out with who. And, you know, we got a good, strong locker room and we've got a lot of uh, senior players. So they understand naturally to be a good team that you have to mix in and, and get to know each other. Um, you know, and it's great to see some of those senior players um, uh, do that and also take some of the younger players under their wings. And, you know, you see like Ka take some of the younger guys after training and um, that's what you want. That's healthy, very healthy in a winning culture is you have senior players who are bringing the younger players along. And um, we have a very good chemistry on this team right now. Our locker room is, is as tight as I've seen in any team I've coached.